I thought this one was just beautiful. Um, really simple but effective. Uh, just great use of light, um, good cinematography. Just interesting, but again, simple. Uh, just really kept me engaged and uh, just had me soaking it in and enjoying it. Definitely recommend Ephemeros. I really liked Ephemeros. It was a very interesting idea. It was a very interesting, you know, premise. Like when she, like when you open and she's in the barrel, you're like. What am I looking at? You know what I'm saying? And that drew me in. You had me asking questions and that drew me in. Uh, it was intriguing. Also, her performance to move her body in ways I could never even imagine, you know what I'm saying, without pulling something. You know what I'm saying? That was that was very impressive. Um, and also the location. Y'all really used the location to the max, the production design. I really like how the mix of the cold blue with the warm orange at different times. That was good director choices. Um, overall, really good that job. Lovely creation of environment and playing with textures and the elements of the natural world. Uh, There's something really stunning about the isolation and the embracing of it with the languidity of the movement. Um, and, and the movement felt very organic, which is interesting. And I found the play with the different... Uh, types of water, different forms of water was also a really interesting theme that permeated the piece for me. But uh, I found it quite entrancing. The, the dancer had so much control and release at the same time that uh, very much drew me in. This was so, so visually like striking and visually really interesting for me. Um, as I was watching it, I was just really intrigued by it. Uh, I liked the tone that they had in the, in the, like, the color tone, which was kind of, like, this blue, and then they just had really interesting visual things that she used as she was dancing, like, the wheel, wheelbarrow and the, like, white powder, I don't know if it was snow or what, and just as it kind of all, like, built together and... It was all incorporated together really, really well to kind of set up this tone and this atmosphere in this room that she 100% felt like she belonged in there, at least like the type of dancing, the type of movement that she was doing and how she was using her surroundings um, all built together really, really, really nicely and visually was really, really intriguing and really striking. I love the juxtaposition in Ephemeris, um, just this construction site and, and the dust and then you have this like human body that's dancing and, and there's this beautiful juxtaposition um, and there's this sense of, of trapped and free and still and movement. I thought it was extremely well done, um, also very optical illusion-y at the start, um, which really piqued my interest. So great. Um, yeah, I thought this one was uh, very interesting. I, I think, you know, it's a very textural short, uh, basically right from the top. You are you get a lot of close-ups, you get a lot of, um, you'd like, that powder, but the really, the thing that, like, drives it home is the sound design um, because, you know, it's, it's super well mixed. There's a lot of diegetic sound, and, yeah, I just thought that it was, it was really interesting. Um, I like the use of the color, kind of. It's very blue, except for... Um, uh, I think it was a lamp, I'm not sure, but the, the spot of warmth, like the orange. Um, yeah, I, I thought it was really, uh, cool, the, the amount that they could kind of ring out from this somewhat simple, uh, setup with, uh, you know, one dancer, basically in one setting, um, and, yeah, I thought, I thought it was a great exercise. To me, it felt like a cycle of life and death um, in the sense that in a very symbolic but also kind of I guess biblical or mythos sense um, being 
earthed from kind of like clay uh the building blocks of life um it felt like in the beginning being born into the world uh, especially with like the lighting that warm orange kind of felt like kind of like when you're inside the womb in a sense uh but then the cold blue is like when you're f like born out into the cold world uh and it felt from that point just um it kind of felt like the dance was learning of the world learning of life before you reach your time and you pass on but before you pass on um you save and spend up the ashes for the next person to be born i could be totally wrong but <laughs> that's that's uh that's what i got from this which was a very interesting take